first thing tells you happy birthday, Carolina. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Today's video is gonna be getting back on track. Oh, yesterday I had a bit of a stressful day and just wasn't motivated, not in my kind of element or where I'm normally at energy wise, productivity wise. So today is going to be episode one of getting back on track. So starting my day with water, I always drink water before like coffee or tea. Today I decided to do lemon water. Yes, I'm still in my PJs. <laughs> Cause I just woke up a bit ago. I slept in till 10 today. But yeah, I wanted to make a note that it's perfectly okay to have bad days, to have bad eating day. I've had a couple celebrations um, with bad food, alcohol, all that lately and have kind of just gone overboard for what is normal for me. And that's perfectly okay. I had some celebrations for people in my life, so that's that's important to me. And definitely don't, don't skip out on those precious moments in your life. But today is a new day. It's not a new week, but today is a new day. And I'm gonna start getting back on track today. So if you guys are interested to see what I do to get back on track, keep watching. Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make coast collide Hold tight, hold tight I made this granola for one of my first videos If you're curious about it, definitely go check it out I love this granola Today I'm having it for breakfast with fruit but it's super healthy, loaded with good fiber, almonds for protein, healthy fats. It has some coconut flakes in it, a bunch of good stuff. And it makes me feel really good when I eat it. coffee is waiting got my granola with blueberries coconut milk and blackberries <laughs> outfit I swear I've been living in these Gymshark sweats the whole quarantine really? are you ready for a walk do you want to go for a walk come here Bailey do you want to go for a walk are you ready to go do you want to go for a walk <laughs> saw me film it but I'm obsessed with eggs and I didn't have eggs for breakfast so this is like a really small egg sandwich with a little bit of white cheddar cheese I'm not 
a big like dairy person. I don't, I try not to eat a lot of dairy, but it's just a little bit. And we had some in our fridge and then some carrots because I have not gotten enough micronutrients in today. track that I think people don't think about sometimes is the mental aspect not just like physically you know eating better or kind of detoxing your body but also mentally so for me um, I told you guys before that I make little lists um, and I have a planner of things that I gotta get done and currently I am studying for the GRE exam to get into a grad school for physical therapy and I have about a month or so to study. That's what I'm doing today. I'm dedicating hours each day to do that because that's what's important to me and that's what getting back on track is all about. So, I've got my green tea, got my planner, got my laptop, got my little station set up ready to go. And yeah, I'm gonna be doing that for a couple hours today. And yeah, I'm gonna take you along the rest of my day. So I couldn't do a getting back on track video without doing a workout or moving my body in some way. I'm going to do a 10, 15 minute incline walk and follow that up with some incline sprints on the treadmill. I love doing those because I get my heart rate up real quick and they burn my legs like crazy. I also have injured my back a little bit. I think I pinched a nerve or I'm something. I'm gonna do movements that don't necessarily work on my back for a little while. I'm definitely gonna focus on some stretching and back stretches today. And I'm probably gonna do a little bit of core and just kind of see how it goes without overly hurting or overly using my back. Wait.